I'm Dalila, and I'm a junior from Southwest. Train wrecking And this is my piece, a simple phrase. Дорогой Иисус, спасибо за этот прошедший день и благослови этот предстоящий день. Аминь. A simple phrase I say every night so often it's become a, a mantra, a life flow. On the nights I felt I couldn't go on anymore, I would pray, bless, благослови, meant everything and sometimes nothing specific. It means so much, even when the words are stuck in my throat and I can barely mumble them. I let myself believe that God hears the whispers of my soul. For every genuine thank you and gratitude on even the days that are the darkest, I always say, dear Jesus, thank you for this past day. With hope, the next will be better. And ask you to bless this next day. Or if not, to have the strength to move forward, to face the disappointment that is myself, that I haven't touched the Bible in years. Yet the only thing keeping me sane is praying, fighting over the contradiction, over the fear to read the Bible. They tell me the only way to heaven is belief in Jesus. The Bible is a guide to understanding him. Yet isn't belief what is in your heart and not what you read? There are many Christians that don't have a gram of belief, just a vast, empty shell to hide a mask of perfection to hide the emptiness inside. But I am also a vast, empty shell, a cracked shell. I don't serve. I don't respect my elders. I have lied. I haven't been a trustworthy eldest child. I am not a perfect Christian. Is there even a point? I am just as capable of committing sin, just as capable to slip. And every time I slip, I ask for forgiveness to the one above. But isn't that abusing a system? Yes, he will forgive, but is there true remorse for the things I have committed? When I ask again and again for the undeserved forgiveness, there is always a nagging self-doubt, always there whispering in my ear, telling me I am not worthy. I shudder at night. So weary from the looping past, dragging me down the void of lonely despair. Forgive me, forgive me, forgive me. It is so lonely down here, so cold and dark. I've, it feels like warmth and light are just myths. A dream that arose from an intangible fantasy created by a desperate mind. And yet, yet you stand there beside me. When my soul forgets your presence, you do not. Guiding me when I'm lost, I feel guilty. Guilty that you give so much to be there. There in the whirlwind of uncertainty, there in festering anger, there in oppressing loneliness, there in, in the black void. When for even a moment I forget you are there. You are still standing beside me, fending off the shadows of my mind. Dear God, thank you for this day, and I ask you to bless the next. Amen. Amen.